after kumaliza college nikaenda tu kupaka cute externa corona ikakam 2020 corona ikakuja corona ika boom bro mm-hmm. kwanza i think corona actually came after like 2 two, two, 3 days bro kapas tukaenda ushago tukampumzisha kwanza hiyo hiyo bro kupasa ilikuwa big blow because they feel sije mungu ni mko sawa tu so <clears throat> So um fast forward mm-hmm. after kuzika tu bro hivi siku mbili lockdown hakuna kutoka Nairobi hakuna kuingia Nairobi tena nikapiga siju I think 3 2 months mwisho ni kasnik nikaingia Nairobi kazi nilifanya ni gani bro nikakuwa mtu wa kuuza mask nilipengwa I think ilikuwa tano nikaenda gikomba nikamenwa mask mingi so udhani wana hapa unaona mlolongo mlolongo yote hakuna mahali sijui so hii time yote nafanya uza mask sitaki wa best wangu wa US US watani bebaje na feel vibaya hii time yote nishe paka Qtex the whole college hakuna mtu ashaijua kama anapaka Qtex bro watu wanajua mimi ni designer wa nguo jumili kwa anapiga look ni tese watu wasijue nafanya nini mm-hmm. like ilikuwa na feature white sana mm-hmm. So niko za mask pia alikuwa anataka kuuza kitengela kitengela najua yote mm. nilikuwa anataka kuuza mask huko pia na hapo nyuma nilikuwa nimeenda attachment citizen bado mhm and attachment citizen nikapiga kazi nikapiga mboka yangu smart sana ukiingia youtube utaonezwa videos ulipataje attachment ya citizen ni ngumu i was a very good student shule mm. na ukiwa nibs kama ni best best student huo natafutiwa attachment. Huo oh, nice. uchoki. Eish. Na yeye kazi ikikuja because Nibs is best for I think watu wana, watu, watu wengi wa technical kwa kwa hizi TV mm-hmm. wametoka wametoka Nibs. Kaka kama si Nibs ni other colleges. Mm-hmm. But because watu wa university wana believeiwa wako best in languages nini mm-hmm. hizi kazi rahisi rahisi. Nibs story ya journalism na nini na um, catering. Iko sawa kabisa. So mm, after kuza mask mask zikakuja zikaisha zikaacha kuuzwa forget mm. so in unajua kiko ulikuwa unauza mask pesa ngapi mask nilikuwa na buy moja 30 bob na uza mba, na uza 50 au oh, usiuliingiza dau mbaya sana ama bado hapa maisha inakupeleka a a mimi nilikuja mask kama zimesha zimeshuka shuka because mask mask zikuza kwanza ilikuwa zina so mbili so Uh, ata so tatu mm. but mimi nilikuja mask kama zimeshashuka okay, mm. unapata kila msia kwa na mask mwenye ana buy ni mwenye anataka tu ni promote au mwenye anataka kuongeza mm. na get uh-huh. so mi mask siku make nazo pesa mingi because nilikuja nilikuja kunilemea mm. nikapata hakuna tunapata nikarudi kwa cute externa nikarudi nice. nikarudi zero tena nikarudi kwa na kupaka cute because at this time Madesa after tulizika bro ya kurudi Nairobi alisema ata irudi Nairobi tena. Nairobi imechukua mtoto wake. So akaamua kukaa home. Ndio ajenge home because kitabu pia stuko na home. So akaamua kujenga home sasa kaja tukatulia katengeneza home pole pole ni nini so fast forward 20 tuko 2021 sasa hivi ndio nikapambana na maisha bro sasa maisha kanipiga real vizuri but wasichana wakanipiga sasa zaidi wasichana ni kama but i like wasichana ni kama hata wanaanga huruma hii ndio ile part inabambanga <laughs> ngoja wasichana si msichana kon zimeisha mmm usha ulilia tumekoniwa ile kukoniwa eh yeah. nimekoniwa na watu wa, wa bundles kuna kwa nyingine tupewe account kwanza kabla eh, ya kina kuna mtu alije nitumia message whatsapp akan, akaniambia nauza bundles ni aina 400 bob unapata 30 GB unatumia mwezi mzima. Uh-huh. Na mimi ni mtu ndio anatumia 1 GB so 30 GB ni ni kila siku 1 GB. Yeah. Nikamtumia mia aina yake fresh. Hadi wale wajeni, ajeni. Hadi wale wajeni unblock. Hiki tumekuanga scam macho. Hata nitumana. Simi watu walikuwa na sema mimi sikutumana but watu walikuwa wanauziwa. Mimi nilikuwa probably kuna nyenye alikuwa anataka advantage of that. Bro, hadi wale wa ajeni ajeni unblock hadi wa leo. Na angalia anga baba nipata kama ameni block anitumie bundles zangu. Surely. Na ndumia damia ine bana. 
Antu ama hiyo miaina anatumia hata 200 but sasa anateseka kwa niliko. Aya, twende sasa kwa mambo ya roho. Ai mapenzi. Mangaldiums. Ni tusheri la menifanyia ni juzi ya majibu ni. Mapenzi, mapenzi ya Kanairo ni mbaya. What a penalty. Ai. Ai, umedate us tena ngapi kwanza in Nairobi? In Nairobi. Mm. I think uh I think ni watatu. Ah. I think ni watatu. Bonsa ndolewe, itole mama, mama twins. <laughs> <laughs> so, excuse the story. Ay, kuna msichana tulikuwa tunapendana. Alikuwa, uo msichana tulimit kwa matatu, nika mpaka Qtex, haka nipea mia. Uka mpakia Qtex kwa matatu? Nika mpaka, si likuwa napaka Qtex kwa matatu? Like, kwa matu mkienda ama? Kwa matu za kuenda western. Oh. So, oh. nika mpaka Qtex, akienda bungoma. Asi bungoma kienda Eldoret, Moy University. Wait, hii Qtex? Siyati ni base mumeka basi ah, ah, station. Kuna base bro. Ni kutembea tembea mnambia ni kwa kwa mati. Unaingia kwa mati unapaka mati. Unaingia kwa mati mtu unapaka kutex. Mati naenda na niachia sombili yake. Mati naenda mi na baki Nairobi. Even ndo nilikuwa napaka. Na hii story yote tukua kone ya kuna mtu anajua kama napaka kutex. Wow. Na pigia luku. Ukiangalia picha zangu za kitamu walikuwa na vasuti. Mm. Ndiyo nificha waitu wa sewa sijua na dunini. Mm. You na feel ashamed of your kitu. Oh nafanya una get because wase na soma nao hata wajui ku hustle nini you understand wajui kulipa bills mimi nalipa rent na mimi ndo nilikuwa naishi maisha mzuri tukiwa college like the whole fucking class mimi ndo nilikuwa nakaa maisha fit at least sasa kuna dem tulikuwa tunapendana alikuwa na u dem yenye nilipaka cute akanipea so huwa moi u msichana alikuwa anatoka moi ana skip class za wiki nzima na kuja kukaa na mimi Hmm. Mimi sijui alinifanyia nini. Sijui aliniambia niko muuzi sana tukaachana. Hakuja <laughs> kufanya ile kitu, si kukaa. But huyo huyo si kwa naishi. Huyo si haikuwa kukaa. Kuja kwa ile kitu. Huyo si kwa naishi una yeye. 2021. I met this certain lady on Facebook. Niseme jina. Unaweza msema kama una shida na. Acha niseme jina yake. Okay. Inaweza ikaleta shida. Sawa. Sasa Sa, msichana mara ya kwanza tulimit kwa kwa anti yake tuseme tu kwao <laughs> tukamit nini alafu next nilikuwa ni invite kwa kwangu kwa nilikuwa nakaa basement mimi badala ya kupanda stairs nilikuwa nashuka nilikuwa nakaa hapo sasa hiyo kao kawa wendani ah. nisha toka kidrai mungu wangu msichana akakuja anakuja nimpeleke salon bro nilikuwa na 1700 mm. bele nyuma mm-hmm. salon ni thao Mpeleke salon na pesa kwa maka shukuri. Yangu okay. bro. Eh hey, Salon ni thao. Mm-hmm. Na fair kutoka kitengela mm-hmm. kuja Nairobi ni so. Kukuja gither mm-hmm. kukuja hadi wendani ni sema ni 50 bob yon 150. 150. Akaniambia fair yake ni thao. Mimi nikamwambia acha nikupei 500 na niko nayo. Nibaki na 200 ni kule. Ah msichana akaenda. Akani test akaniambia mimi si hizi date maana umeona pesa. Kasha shukuri nywele. Asha shuko nywele bro. Kaniambia sisi date mwanaume ana pesa. Kuna kitu bro nilimaliza kama hiyo. Nikijua nimekulipia salon ya dhao na nikakupiga punch 500, mimi nikabaki nikabaki na 200 bro. Ndio asubuhi at least niende sasa taoni dhuko mezingine. Na ananiambia bro wezi ni date juu sina pesa. Waambu ndio huyu hapa anaweza kushowe screenshot. Sako nayo hadi wa leo. Nikaambia msichana please nivumilie. Every a uh, lovely couple kwa hapa nje nyenye make it they have a story nikamwambia nivumilie mimi nakupenda mm. i want to do a life with you tukimaliza ambia ambao kwa show screenshot it ni kitu iko hata sijua aliitwaje kwa sasa e unaweza uta post na utakata uweke hapo ambao hope uko nayo tusi iko tuseme tayari ako nayo ako nayo <laughs> bro msia ni kama suka yeah. because mimi nilikuwa nishawa na life na yeye akaniambia pana i can't date a fucking broke guy mtaje huyo akaniambia hivyo bro ilikuwa ilikuwa may stay sawa 2021 sikumbuki the exact date sawa but nikiangalia picha naweza kumbuka the line so june 2021 first nilikuwa na channel kutoka 2019 mm-hmm. but sikuwa na post so, ilikuwa i think ilikuwa na subscribers 519 520 something hapo mm-hmm. nikaanza na post na sikuwa na post nikaanza ku post 3 months later nikakuwa monetized sawa nikakuwa monetized so hiyo ni september october ah uh-uh, november nikapata my first youtube uh, income sawa haikuchange maisha 
Ona kuna uh, post post nini your time? Your time siku za kwanza nilikuwa napika vlogs nini. Mm. After June ilisha hapo July nikaanza content za ku interview watu nini. Mm-hmm. On I think 10th October nikakutana na Nsongo nikafanya sasa video yenye ilinitoa. Mm. Bro video ka blow ilikuwa na trend everywhere Kenya mzima. Okay. Ule demo akani text. Aki akaniambia ki I'm sorry I take back my words. Kumbia you, your words what end of kind of uko. Ngo miki uko tuko na tofauti. Mimi ni kijana mzuri hapa nje lakini mimi nasema asiatiangi karma kazi. Mimi ningemtafuta. Eh, sitakupea story tulia. Twende. Story jaisha. I can feel you. Sikia. <laughs> January. Mambo itisha hiyo story. 2022. 2022. Uh-huh. Sasa ndio sasa jina ikaanza kuikaingia town vizuri sasa vizuri kabisa. Uh-huh. January. 2022 nikakutana na msichana anaitwa Wambui Ashley Karioki. Mhm. Sawa. Sikido kidogo malavi Davi nini nika a, nika post online. Sawa. Mhm. Nika post online. Instagram. Wambu, history na kupewa Wambua juu. Mm. Tulea, tulea. Take position. Take position. Hii ita, itakushtua. Ule msichana akani text tena ananiambia walae I'm um, the perfect match. Omsiano um, kona hata wezi amekonda. Nikamwambia ni sawa amekonda. Let's meet today. Time for us to same location. Nikamwambia to meet tukutane. Sawa? Mhm. Munono wewe. Wewe zipo wewe mali safi. Anakuja. <laughs> Nikaenda nikamba nikamwambia by the way nimekona na nimeenda. To meet nimekona na nimeenda nikamwacha hapo. You can imagine. Ama ni mfanya vibaya msichana anaishi yale. anaishi maisha ina gani? Aya na mwananga huko TikTok akistruggle. Kibara wa pastrata, pastrata. Nitakupea account ukitoka hapa. So tuli meet, nikamwambia by then nimekuona na nimeenda. Hivyo tu. Sasa huyu hataka ni at break. Kwa na mwingine sasa ni at break sasa vizuri. Mhm. Nikamkatia vizuri. Tuli meet Facebook, aki Facebook ina nilifanyia mbaya. Wala watu wenye mlikuja Facebook mkijiita mimi nakumbuka nilikuwa naji nilikuwa najiita je Facebook nilikuwa najiita Mavado nilikuwa najiita Boogies Canva Sigla Yeye ndio nini si Boogies ilikuwa ka Boogie mm-hmm. Ken ni jina langu Kennedy mm-hmm. Va Sigla ni movie fulani ya Kihindi niko shule like what ilikuwa ya robot inaitwa robot racha mwenye amezitengeneza aitwa Dr something Va Sigla Sikiza <laughs> nikakutana na mwingine Facebook huko msichana yeah. chupa akaa vizuri nini but yeye anakaa chura kai vizuri sasa huyu mchana nikamtengenezea chupa akaona niko na chupa iko na picha yangu bro hapo hii asheona kitu kama hiyo nikamtengenezea chupa ngoja is a editing ah ah ya ukweli chupa yani ah what a can oh unajua kuna hizo facebook pictures ziko na chupa hii ah what a can kienda kumitu mchana huyu mchana tu limit akaniona na wata kana kaniambia guy nitengenezee yangu nikamtengenezea huyu mchana hadi wa leo hadi wa leo kutoka 2021 hadi wa leo aje kujia chupa mimi nadhani nataka kusema kuna hiyo chupa aje kujia iko wapi ni mambo ni dupa ni mambo alikuja kuenda wapi na wambu tulikaa na yeye for almost 6 months hiyo chupa iko kwa nyumba na hata ajui. Nilikuwa nimefikia chini ya kitanda. Huko unaamini chupa ija kujiwa. Si liko at broken bro. Na believe huyu msichana siku moja ataamka alipewa. Alienda wapi? Alienda wapi? Unajua hii. Alikuwa alikuwa na nyoo tulikuwa tunaongea. Tulikuwa tunapiga story anambia. Namwambia ili fika tu point baada nikaanza kumsuka na kumwambia wewe nitakupenda. Tulia hata kama sina pesa. Nini? Nilikuwa nishajua sina kwa kitu swali. Yeye alikuwa na issue na dau. Sijui hapo ananiwesha mimi nilikuwa nishajua sasa. Yaani huyu alienda tu, azini huyu alienda tu. Eh. But ashe kuja kwenye text tena siku fulani alikuwa anaenda mali. Kaniambia I, 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 I remember ukinikatia ulikuwa na proposal. If I say yes now what will happen? Tumbi I just hear it. Ah ah nilimwambia there is someone in picture. Nikamwambia <laughs> tolea. Eh <laughs> wasichana wameonyesha mambo hii town. Unaambia your picture is still on the bottle. <laughs> We. We. Baby you chupu ulipeleka wapi? Ali dump company fulani alikuwa anafanya kazi huko so aliacha. Ni hata hizi tupo kwa trash ya home. Mm. Tunaitravelisha. 
But finally, Mulinitesa have a beautiful wife. Mm -hmm. Mama. Mama Mono Queen. Mama Twins. Mama Boys. Twins. Mama Boys. Mama Boys. Mama Boys. Mama Boys. So, I was trying to water. I was trying to water. I do a little bit of DM. But uh, let me tell people out there, kitu moja. Mm -hmm. Never, ever despise someone. Hakuna mtu anajua tomorrow isipokuwa Mungu peke yake. Because utakataka sheri leo. We don't want break for. You use that example, eh? Huh? <laughs> use that. Uta na pesa bana. Utakataka bogi venye. Utakataa tu kabogi for example. Venye venye mimi si useme adio. Ajaunga. Wacha wacha nitumie sheri ndio na make sense. Utakataa sheri, mtu utakataa sheri. Sheri kesho tamka akiwa msichana wa the first son. Amen. Yeah, like, I, 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 sasa tumia yango. Nitumie yako sasa. Mark that word. Like una get. Like ma, 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 uh, mi sina issue na madem. Mm. But me feel madem sometimes. You're I like patient. those ladies wenye wana tulianga na wanaume wana grow now pamoja. Mm, mm. Yani wana grow tu. Wana jua kuna know, kesho. Yeah. Wambu ni msiali ni believe. Wambu wala nipata. Eh hey, wambu wala nipata kama niko down bro. Mm. Uge nipata niko na tuduwa fulani. But stay ku spend ni sisote. You unajua kusota ni nini. You unaget. Mm, mm. Because ata wambu wala nyumbu. Eh nyumbu yaki liko meweza bro. Hili yana kudem. Bro nika feel challenged the following day nika buy kit nika buy carpet tv <laughs> nini siko na vitu <laughs> wasichana utoa wapi ndio baby mimi juli za hivyo bro nika shindwa kwani udem ni wa masponyo unajua mimi one of the things nimefanyanga nika grow kwa wangu nilikuwa nataka kwa madem mm. alafu kuna venye wanakuwa na haja kwenda kwa madem wewe no like una kwa mabest ulikuwa 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 kwa sheri likufanya nini no si kwa sheri oh my was jana nyingine oh sheri alikuwa mko Ana kujanga ni mbona unasema kujangi kwangu No like nasema sasa hiyo prior like tell me Oh before we met we met before mwanza ku date Oh Guys kuonea eh tunakuonea Yes Sasa tupe tupe short story ya mbona Wasichana walikuwa na nini But angalau tupatie kani Ah kuna msana chini text nikiwa na wewe akiniambia nataka kunikujia bado I wish mama tumsonge Okay, mtafanya yake. Mambo tunamleta wewe. But so, I feel like na, girls uh, one one thing, mm. ladies, I, I tunakwangana pressure ya ukiona beshti yako ana date mtu tajiri, mm. hata unataka hiyo kitu saa hii saa hii. Exactly. So una pressure boyfriend wako into wanting to have Mi, that. Wambu is one lady. Right. Mwenye hiyo siku nilimmeet hapa nilimwambia, ah wewe najua ni yaka date na umeana hutairudi tena. Because nilikuwa na experience hiyo kitu kwa wasichana wengi. Mm -hmm. Msema nilikuwa nakuja na meet, tuna have lunch nini anakula na hata wewe rudi tena imeisha hivyo. Mm -hmm. So na kwaachia chupa. Wambu mimi siku ziku dhani hata 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 nipenda but alinivumilia, akani encourage, akani pay ideas like to me grow. Me I can say to commit na Wambu only the, the only thing I had maybe ni akili. Una get sikuwa na pesa sikuwa na anything but to make grow for the Poland and i think the growth is visible out there mm -hmm. watu wanaona yeah um uh, imekuwa ime amazing ni mwanamke mzuri ananipenda si jamani ni hata jana kanipa iphone iphone 13 max mm -hmm. mapenzi yeah. unanielewa uh, like ni msichana mzuri hakuwai akuwa niambia ati au na pesa sijui nini mm. na alikuwa analipo hata eh eh so tumesaidiana naye sana yani mimi mm -hmm. mm. feel i don't know any personal feel yangu mimi mm. feel kama madem wengi wenye huu wenye wingi za hiyo mentality anataka mwanaume akona do lazima kuwa na do mingi ni wenye wananga juu na stories zote za wasi wenye mimi nimesikia wamekaa na madem wenye wanawavumilia mostly hadi umdem yuko angana an Eh yeah. like kuna sikia mwanaume alikuwa nje endo kuangalia di stories za ama celebs juu kama ni story za kufikiwa kama ma pastor usema kila pastor ashaivuta fegi but eh, yuko kwa huu mdema alikuwa angana mm. I guess uh, kina dada ambao wako broke as me <laughs> as us ndio wanafikiri eh. kama ni makosa kuwa na mtu bro mm. nao madem unapatangata wafanyangi kazi mm. number one mm. but usi mwambu alikuwa na work mimi mm. alikuwa na work na actually 
alikuwa na an pesa kidogo kuniliko but alikuwa amefanya vitu mingi kuniliko eh yeah, alikuwa msichana alikuwa na nyumba kali enda uangalie tu video ya yenye uko na views mingi kwa channel yake ni house tuende uangalie nyumba bro alafu sijui kama naweza pata picha za hiyo eh hey, bro nyumba yangu liko ve beats carpet yenye liko na hakuipata nilirusha nyumba ni nyumba ya nyumba asipate bro liko imechapa kama kitu kingine liko imeraduka hivi mm. ulipata kwangu kwa na carpet Eh lima bila enda kuoshwa. Eh ndio kape timeenda kuoshwa. So imekuwa amazing. Mwanzo tumepiga stories za 2 hours. Amen. Kio kwa Kio kwa Nairobi nimetenda huku mtoto wa nyaya. Sana. Sasa hizi kijana ana drive. Na ana drive hadi hao wasichana crazy wenye walikuwa wanamkata. Mzee. Kijana ni mzee baba ya watoto wawili. Mhm. Man, congrats by the way. Thanks bro. Ndio tuko na makosa moja sana sijui ni tumii platform kwa apologize. Kwa nini? Tukuje kuona. Tolea, tolea. We will talk of camera bro. No, but, but we must apologize. You know one, one of the things mm. mm. keep posting the community hapo na time mimi nilireceive hizo comments. Keep post? Eh muende muone twins. Unajua tulikuja ngata time ambayo alikuwa pregnant. Mm. So tulikuwa mbona mjaenda kwa mbona mbona mjaienda. Mm. So yes, mafans wa Kioko Poleni, we gonna work on this very soon. Mm-hmm. Actually ilikuwa tufanye like guest time ikasonga sana. Yeah. Yeah, so we are coming. Mm. Mama Twins, wherever you are, I know you are not here. You are not looking at me even right now, mm. but we are sorry. <laughs> yeah, we are sorry. <laughs> we. Mi, mi, my main my main lesson from this story is ladies, pay any chance. Vumilia tu. Vumilia tu. If someone has a vision, pay time. But also look for your own money. There is nothing as good as a woman having her own money. Hello. Hello. Unajua mwenye anaongea ni kama au si ni kama amejaa. Nimezambia hata anikubali. Eh mkubali kabuge ako na vision. Yes by the way unapata ngaa msiana do but ako na vision. Eh anajua what he wants. So una propose them idea unamwambia tutakuwa hivi in 2 years nini nini. Them she them such ladies bro ni kama wafikiri yangi in the future wanafikiri anga saa hii mm-hmm. niende apate sponyo apewe 10k ya lipe na travel anzo yes. kwenda kwa life but at end of the day anyway but maisha ni ya mtu pia yeah sasa so, so, shkadao <laughs> finally you asked for kioko he is here he was here i hope the story ni wabamba man we are really working on having one boy here next mhm uh, atujui kama atatuletea things atawapiti shup shup mimi nitafanya motherhood na yeye. Mtanisamea. I I have Mtanisamea because you know I'm good at interviewing. Mm-hmm. So maybe maswali zingine sijajibu vizuri. It's okay. You know. No, no. Kufiti but it's a good storyteller. Mimi enjoy niko nimezuba tu mimi. So nikifanya introduction yangu nisemanga pia ma storyteller. Ah. Achana naye. Kumbaya basi. Anyways. Waskedao wewe unasema waskedao kabla ule amalizie waskedao sawa tuseme mara moja hapana utasema yako oh waskedao waskedao wa